Are you wondering if you should get Brainwork or Peppertype AI? Both have some similarities, but there are some huge differences that you need to be aware of before you buy. So keep watching to see my head-to-head -head match between these two AI content writers. All right, guys, so if I'm speaking too slow, feel free to just uh, click the chapters in the description and watch until the end where I'll uh, show you my free SEO checklist uh, that you can claim completely free. So let's start off with uh, Brainwork versus Peppertype AI. So both are AI-powered writing assistants. They use artificial intelligence to generate copy, but they're very, very different. So I'm going to start off with Brainwork and tell you my thoughts about it and take you through some examples. So I'm logged into my Brainwork and this is the, the AI writing assistant um, kind of dashboard here. And you could do titles, outlines, keyword research. And what I want to show you is their AI writing assistant, their long form editor. So I'm just going to click on new post and just do affiliate marketing tips, hit continue, and it will tell you um, what keywords you should be targeting in your article. So I'm just gonna click on uh, a couple of them here, and you can add additional keywords too. So for example, I could say SEO. Um, I wanna talk about YouTube, so I'm gonna add YouTube there. So I know to target those keywords when I write my long form content. So I'm gonna click on create, and this is the, the long form editor. You can edit your copy however you wish on the kitchen sink above. And if you click on the assistant, this is where the power comes in. So you can tell it to generate titles. So when I click on generate, it will give you um, these five titles. How to generate more sales through affiliate marketing, how to get started with affiliate marketing, the top 10 affiliate marketing tips, I like this one, so you just hit that plus button and it will appear here. And then you can also tell the AI to generate more for you if you don't like the first five. And you can also generate outlines. So if you click on generate, it will give you um, one outline and it has introduction. Affiliate marketing can be a great way to make money online, but it's not easy. Tip one, two, and there's 10 and it's cool because it says top 10 affiliate marketing tips and the outline gave me 10. So that's pretty genius. So you click that plus button and you add it there and then you can generate more if you wish. And let's see what kind of other options it has. So this one is not as good. This one is not as good mainly because the formatting is kind of off, but the actual content is not too bad it's definitely not too bad so this second option is 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 a usable one and then with seo this will give you an seo score so right now it's 68 and you can kind of follow their direction so it tells you to make sure you have keyword and headings so i think my keyword is, was affiliate marketing tip so Affiliate marketing tips, let's see if 68, this is a heading, let's just turn that into an H2. Let's see if it changes or not. Okay, it jumped up the score and then it's the turned green, keyword and heading. So it does work. And you can add a featured image here as well. And keywords, so this is the list of keywords that it recommends you add to your body copy. So, you know, primary keyword, uh, related and selected, and it even gives you top questions. So wherever you have your cursor, it will add the keyword. So my cursor is right here. You can add this button, and then it will automatically paste that keyword right there, right? And you can also tell it to actually write content. So you can highlight, and there's these different options here. So you can tell it to write a paragraph, All right, products, do your research. Okay, so now it's kind of listing out the tips, uh, which doesn't make sense because I'm having these top 10 tips as my outline. So you definitely need to, you know, play around with it. Uh, but just to, for the sake of the video, you can even 
create listicles. So for example, you can highlight this sentence. Actually, it's too long, but look for niche products. You can click on listicle and then it will list out um, a list of, of items here, right? And it kind of makes sense. So I'm gonna do Control Z, Command Z to undo that. You can even do steps. So let's just say, find a good affiliate network. I want to create a list of steps. So you can click on that. Research, select, sign up. So this is actually really good. <laughs> this is actually really, really good. Uh, and you can even rephrase. So let's just say, start promoting the affiliate network. Doesn't make two cents for me, so I'm gonna just hit rephrase. Promote the affiliate network to help increase sales and traffic. That's okay. Uh, and you can redo it again or you could summarize it. So let's just say we want to summarize this paragraph. Just hit summarize. And it kind of summarized it. I'm not going to read through the whole thing, but it makes sense, but I'm not sure if it's a summary. And yeah, and then you can also do the exact same in this pop-up uh, widget right here. And then you can preview it and then save it. So I'm gonna save it. Now it's saved as drafts. And then if I go back to my long form writing assistant, it's listed right here, all right? And it tells me all of this information. And then you could do ad hoc blog titles, outlines, and do your keyword research here. And then it'll tie into the AI writing assistant, all right? So that's the gist of framework. I'm gonna open this back up just so we have it. Now. PepperType AI. So this one is another AI content writer. This is the, the dashboard and immediately it's very, very different. So PepperType AI really focuses on the different types of content types or templates. So you have, you know, uh, different social media templates like tweet ideas, post captions, ad copy. Uh, headlines, descriptions, bullet points, uh, you know, blog ideas, Quora answers, e-com and product focused content types. So Brainwork does not have these content types, all right? So Brainwork is mainly the long form editor. And this one is just the short form. Now they do have a long form editor coming up really, really soon. It's called Notes. And this is a screenshot of how it will look like. So you can write your copy on the right. You see the different uh, outputs on the left. And then you can toggle between different templates on the left as well. So very similar to Jasper, if you've used that before, it looks like PepperType is kind of following and mimicking the UI UX of Jasper. Um, but, I, but I don't have access to this long form editor, so I can't comment on it. But let's just say, um, let's just say headline, right? So let's just try to create a headline. Actually, let's go back to Brainwork. Um, this is the, the title. I think this is a really good headline. So let's just see if PepperType can generate a good headline as well. So affiliate marketing tips, description, we offer, uh, let's see, uh, important affiliate marketing tips and tricks for users to make money online easily and quickly. So just give it some helpful descriptions, create content. Now let's see what kind of headlines it generates. Learn the secrets of making money online from scratch, make money with affiliate marketing, tips and tricks, Okay, these are not too bad. 25 proven ways, learn how to make money online easily. So it's not too bad. Let's go back and let's see if, yeah, so there isn't really like a, a title template in, aside from just the Amazon. So I think headline would be your title. Let's see if there's other blog ideas. Let's do blog ideas and affiliate, oops, affiliate marketing tips, create content. All right, affiliate success stories, top 10 affiliate marketing tips, blog posts on the top 10, quick tips. 
So these are good blog ideas as well. These are good blog ideas as well. Uh, but I kind of like the titles that Brainwork is offering. It just makes sense. And I actually see myself writing these on my own, you know, like how to get started with affiliate marketing, top 10 affiliate marketing tips, dirty little secrets of affiliate marketing coming from pepper type. These are good too. Um, both are good, honestly, but I kind of like the brainwork titles. So, and then you can copy them, you know, copy them and paste them on your word document or go to brainwork and then, you know, paste it there if you wish you can save it and then it will be saved under your saved copies and let's do an outline because we already uh, created an outline for brainwork so let's do outline for pepper type but in terms of creating the headlines who wins i would say brainwork wins when it comes to creating headlines and titles as you kind of saw in my example so the winner for headline creation is brainwork so with pepper type, let's create an outline. So blog outline, affiliate marketing tips, create content. Now let's see what it spits out. How to make money from ClickBank, Amazon affiliate marketing. These two make sense. This one is the title of the article. So that doesn't make sense. Basics, program strategies tips um let's see each one of these have issues i would need to kind of mix and match and maybe combine a couple of of outputs together into one outline so which affiliate marketing is kind of website that doesn't make sense what is more important than if what is more important in affiliate marketing that doesn't make total sense how to get more sales what is the most effective promotion method tips affiliate marketing tips tips for affiliate marketing experts so and then the outline for brainwork is this this just makes so much more sense brainwork just makes so much more sense when it comes to outline so who wins when it comes to outline generation I would say Brainwork. Brainwork wins with outline generation. All right. So, uh, so what's the verdict? So what's the verdict here? Uh, with Brainwork, the outputs are clearly much better, right? Brainwork does not have the different content templates and the content types. So Brainwork is all about writing blog content, long form writing. Pepper type is more short form. They are coming out with their notes, which is their long form editor. I can't comment on it since I don't have access, but the verdict is um, brain work. And not only because of the outputs, but also if you actually want to purchase one of these, uh, they both are on AppSumo. And Brainwork is starting at 79 bucks, right? So there's up to four tiers you can uh, purchase. Tier one, 40,000 words, two users. Now on PepperType's uh, page, their sales page, it's 59, which is cheaper, but you get 7,500 words per month and 7,500 long form words per month for 59. But with Brainwork, it's 20 bucks more, but you get way more uh, words, right? And with tier two, it's 160 and you get 100,000. See, and you can't even get 100,000 uh, long form content words per month with pepper type, right? You get the unlimited total words per month with the, you know, these content templates, but the long form editor, you are limited to max 70,000, while with Brainwork, you can get up to 500,000. So the deal is much better for Brainwork. So you will be getting your money's worth for Brainwork more than PepperType. All right. It's just a, couple, a few dollars more Brainwork. Honestly, I would invest in Brainwork 
Now with PepperType, the advantage is they're all of these 20 plus templates that they have and Brainwork doesn't have that. So, um, so if you want these short form social media posts, uh, you know, engaging questions, bio, personal bio, get PepperType. But if you are a blogger, if you have an affiliate website and you want to generate content easily, quickly, then get Brainwork. So my final verdict is Brainwork. All right, so now that you've sticked with me until the end, um, I want to gift you a free SEO checklist. So if you want to be successful with SEO content writing, not only should you be writing good copy, but you need to make sure you are optimizing your website. So I created a 100 plus point checklist that will kind of guide you to exactly what you need to do to optimize your entire website. So on page, off page, it has local SEO uh, checkpoints. So if you want this free checklist, uh, click the link in the description, add your first name and your email, and I'll instantly email you this free checklist that you could use to start ranking number one in Google. So hopefully you enjoyed this video and I will see you all in the next one. All right, so let me know if you are gonna get Brainwork or PepperType AI in the descriptions below. And if you wanna check out my other reviews, feel free to click any of these two videos right here. All right, I'll see you in the next one.